The National Employment Authority Act gives effect to Article 55C and 56B of the Constitution providing a legal framework for the state while establishing an authority that will assume the functions of the National Employment Bureau whose mandate is to maintain a database for all jobless youth to facilitate their employment. Other bills include the Small Claims Court Act, which actualizes the provisions of Article 48 and 169 of the Constitution by establishing a small claims court meant to expedite solving of disputes relating to small monetary claims through informal and affordable avenues while adhering to the principles of law and natural justice. The mediated version of the County Government Act, passed by both Houses of Parliament, designates the physical headquarters for all the 47 counties in the country. The mediated version of the National Drought Management Authority Act anchors into law the National Drought Management Authority. The authority is envisaged to be responsible for matters relating to drought preparedness, mitigation and coordinated response to adverse effects throughout the country. Meanwhile, the cabinet held its meeting today and, among other things, approved the Urban Areas and Cities Amendment Bill 2015, which encouraged counties to align their urban areas and cities to specific functions and resource endowment for sustainable development of the National Housing Policy 2015. The meeting also approved ratification of the protocol to the Constitutive Act of the African Union relating to the Pan African Parliament. The establishment of the Africa Regional Center for the International Electrotechnical Commission in Nairobi, Kenya. It also ratified the East African Community Protocol on Privileges and Immunities aimed at widening and deepening integration among the partner states. Among other issues adopted in the meeting included ratification of the agreement Kenya and the United States of America concerning cooperation in threat reduction, biological engagement programs and the hosting of the Africa Green Revolution Forum from September 2016. For KBC News Hour, Rose Gakuo.